Hi, Beach, and welcome back to my channel. I got an extra special Dolls Kill haul coming right at you. I will be styled in the latest Current Moods collection. I will be trying on the majority of their lookbook, so be excited. I'm gonna show you some spring, summery kind of looks, but I live in the state of Iowa, and we're just now getting weather that's above 30 degrees, so. I'm about to live my spring summery life in front of my lights and my camera for you guys. And as usual, you will find names, links, and sizes to all of the products I review in this video in the description box down below, as well as my measurements for your viewing reference. So I'm gonna shimmy into this haul. This is a really adorable, super comfortable terry cloth skirt set. It's a halter top, so it ties around your neck and you can make an adjustment right around here, right below your bust line. There are cutouts, kind of like under booby kind of cutouts. The skirt also has cutouts, so you can show off thin hips. And you can adjust both sides. It's very comfortable. I'm not a big fan of terry cloth as a uh, clothing fabric. This is gonna change my mind because this is so freaking comfortable and so simple to make this look good. So I put on some wedges so we style it. I also got two bucket hats in pink and a baby blue kind of color. I used to wear hats all the time. This is the first time I'm wearing a hat probably since high school. I don't know. But this is a springy, summery kind of look. And I really don't think it matters which color I wear because I wear what I want. I also have a really tiny head, so I have a problem with things trying to fit my small head. And here is the blue bucket hat. Nothing screams springy, summery, as loud as floral prints. I have a floral print two-piece outfit. We got a top. It's a tank top with adjustable straps, and there's a little bit of the kind of spandex ruched thing going. I don't know what the hell to call this right now. Anyway, you know what I mean. And it's kind of like a little bit of a crop top and it's that mesh material, but there is a liner in the top. So you do have full coverage here. And I'm wearing a bra, so you can't see the bra strap on the backside either. Take a look. The skirt is short. It's a mini skirt. It's cute. It's fabulous, okay? Wear it on a hot summer day. It's form fitting, it's very comfortable, and again, it does have that liner underneath here. This form fitting ruse dress has that beautiful floral print just like my last outfit. It's got puff sleeves. There's a little bit of an elastic stretch in there so your arms don't get squished. Down the front are buttons. It's all snap buttons, girlfriend. Easy access up in here. You know what I mean. You got good support for your girls because there is a built-in underwire bra kind of thing going on here. And of course, it makes your butt look good, girl. I think I have every piece in this collection with this floral print. Again, it is that bold floral print color because of the material. It's a stretch material. I was able to get in it without a problem, but it is pretty snug, especially through the arms and just a little bit like around where my hips are located. And it feels like if I move around too much that the dress would hike up. It is supposed to be a mini dress. So you can almost anticipate that happening. Along the sides are buttons. Buttons on the side. I'm wearing a bra underneath this and you can see it where the button hole areas are and you'd be able to see underwear as well. So definitely wear a nude pair of underwear or just make sure you're covered somehow down there, especially with the skirt riding up on you. And of course there's this little button on the front, you know, let your cleavage peek out a little bit.
All right, we're finally moving on from that floral print to this very fruity print. Again, really spring summery fruits. The skirt has that vibrant look to it because it is that satin material and it's ruched and cinched along here. This is like, which side is this? The left side. The left side has the ruched thing here. The top is that mesh material. It is see-through. I am wearing pasties underneath here. You can do whatever you want, girl. Okay, this is the kind of coverage that I'm doing. And this is a fully adjustable top, okay? You've got ties on your shoulder that function as your straps. And then you have ties in the front holding you in. So you can adjust all of this. And I think the vibrant color of the skirt really offsets the, um, opacity of the mesh material up top so you know i decided to give the bucket hats a chance with this outfit because the pink and the baby blue color that the bucket hats are in seem to match the blue and pink color in the skirt. So even though the top is very understated, the skirt is bold, the hat is bold. I think it offsets everything, but tell me otherwise. I was a little confused when I first put on this dress because I thought the straps were supposed to crisscross in the front. They're supposed to crisscross in the back. Personally, I thought they looked sexy crisscross in the front. So I'm gonna show you what that looks like anyway. Otherwise, this is that fruit pattern, just like my last outfit. It doesn't look as vibrant because it is mesh on the outside and there's a black liner underneath it that's pretty thick material. Overall, I think the dress is very comfortable. It does have these off the shoulder sleeves that aren't very elastic like i'm really tugging on this so if you're a thick arm girl like me consider going up a size or expect this to be a little bit too snug for you otherwise the dress is very form fitting but i also like that it flares out around your waist and your hips it just lays on your curves real nice This is the most simple dress from this haul, obviously because it's one color, no patterns or anything. It's just a beautiful black spring summery dress. And I say spring summery because the material is very light and breathable everywhere below the bust line. Bust line, all of this is super tight. There really isn't any wiggle room here. You put the dress on and there's a zipper on the side and it's actually two straps on each side and there's spaghetti straps so you can adjust both of the straps on both these sides. There's this string hanging down the front. I'm sure you can do whatever you want with it. I'm just letting it hang out. Otherwise, it's a very cute dress. It accentuates my curves in a different way because it flares out at the end. Material soft. But I'd worry about how it feels and fits in the bust line area than here. First of all, I decided not to take the wedges off because I am way too lazy to do that. So this is gonna be the look, even though I would not wear shoes with this outfit at all. It's more like loungewear, PJs, and it's actually very comfortable. The top is a little on the snug side through here, but I'm also wearing a bra, so that's probably why. Otherwise, it's like a crop t-shirt and it says, everything's fun. And normally I wouldn't buy anything with profanity, but you know, this is something that you're gonna wear inside in the privacy of your own home. The vibe is very hippie, very relaxed with clouds and butterflies and sunshine and rainbows. 
and we have the same thing going on with the bottoms. The bottoms are kind of like, I don't want to say granny panties or anything, but they kind of are, but they're really, really comfortable and they're made of that stretchy polyester rayon material. So I feel very comfortable wearing them. I would for real wear this around the house. It's very comfortable. Okay, I'm gonna turn around and you're gonna see what I mean about the granny panty thing. I have like island booty going on here. Yeah, probably not the most flattering on the backside, but I don't care because it's super comfortable and that's all that matters. Oh, and it says everything is on the backside. I also assume in a warmer setting, you might actually be able to wear this out like to the beach or a boardwalk or something like that. I live in Iowa, so I don't live that life, but you could wear that bucket hat with this outfit and I'm gonna show you what it looks like with the pink one. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did make sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already make sure you take a look at the current moods latest collection on dolls kill and let me know in the comments down below which outfit or product was your favorite from this haul or your least favorite and remember to watch the curve on your way out